with a gaming teacher here and welcome back and we're going to continue this let's play this i believe is part six now so we're working our way through it slowly but surely i think that's the way to look at it um first of all we've actually getting some divisions actually being produced so we're going to unassign these to our well, from the training core here and we can if we deselect that and we've got infantry division here we can put them onto this army here now, if we place them over here, hopefully we can kind of bring them into the um, battle plan which I want them to actually start performing. I'm going to play it again and unpause and let it run through. It's got these destroyers, put them to the destroy fleet, stop the mission, search and destroy, bring them back. Select them, merge, search and destroy again, and over here. So the reason why we're doing this is because don't forget the German subs will be a problem and destroyers will be vitally important in protecting um, us against the submarines. But here's the thing I was thinking of last time, I was wondering if it would be a better idea putting some of these ships in with the destroyers because we, I'm only assuming that they're going to have a very heavy submarine navy. I'm not even taking into consideration there might be battleships and cruisers there. Not at all. So, with that in mind, I've, we've got a navy on standby here because our battle is going to be around here. It's it, That's going to happen. Um, now, we've got research being made, which is uh, being completed, which is fantastic. Um, now we talked about this last time didn't we I'm gonna place research the ability for the planes to land on carriers which is also quite beneficial now what's probably gonna happen Italy's probably gonna join the Axis and I was thinking we wasn't we was gonna leave this alone but I actually don't want to do that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to place these into a division. I think these are going to be separate. But we can potentially put them into a division. Right, so these have got the belong to an army, but after the long arm is uh, no order. So first of all, let's first... Um, Here we go, reconnaissance, which is fantastic. So recon is always important. Okay, and what we're gonna do, I wanna place them as, I'm gonna give the first battle plan, and it's one of these down here. Let's have a front line. Let's put a front line here. Just spread out. Actually, let's do that again. Let's do that. And we'll get the front line starting. Oh, we have to. Yeah, no, it's the same. I wanted to start from here, but that, that's because that's the whole entire province. This. Okay, so that, that'll be our front line, and then they can prepare a battle plan. We can potentially. Let's start an offensive line as well. There we go. So that can be our battle plan for Italy. So, <coughs> excuse me, I want to actually take this. We might as well, might as well go for it. Now, three civilian factories. I think last time I was going through here and thinking there's civilian factories because I saw the green and I got confused with the green here. Oh, that's a basic mistake. So um, we've got three civilian factories, which is great. I'm still gonna continue building with civilian factories. Let's have a look at um, recruitment. Let's get some more civilian factories. Attempt to do military as well. Might help us out a bit. Let's do the rest civilian. 
as that production goes up. There we go. Perfect. No national focus. Uh, what can we do? Three percent. See, I want this. We need five percent world tension. Still not enough. Still not enough for this. Still not enough for that. We did home defense last time, didn't we? Was it a home defense? I didn't see when it popped up. Let's pause again. Actually, let's continue playing it. Ah, right. This will increase world tension. Requires home defense. Game base, national unity. Oh, we're not in a, um, a war at the moment. Or oh, we're not in 20% world tension. Mediterranean. Right, we're going to go for Scandinavian intervention. Let's let's shake things up a bit. Let's let's increase some world tension. Ah. We can't. We can't because look, one of the following must be true. Which we haven't. We haven't got any of the requirements for this to be implied. So, what we're going to do, we're do the Mediterranean coastal forts, which is going to help us in the Mediterranean. Again, I'm not going to be focused around here too much. I don't want to. Just for the sake of it. Um, give them order. Uh, the Hindenburg disaster. Putting hydrogen into balloons instead of helium. The only problem is with hydrogen, it um, is flammable. Okay. Bridge incident. Ah, then this this will be the start of the Chinese and Japanese war. Right. Let's just let's take him. Modified government. What else can we do? Volunteer only, 1.5, 2.5. Nope. Free trade. Right, resources to market 50%, factory output 10%, factory output 15%. Research time. Hmm. Resources to market plus 80%. I'm not sure about that yet. Let's let's have a look at the aircraft. And I want to focus on the fighters because we're gonna light aircraft design fighter. Yeah, let's go for this because I'm gonna be focusing a lot on the fighters. Right, we've got research. We can't um, do the Spitfire yet. Researching bombers, which is fine. Now let's start here. Air superiority. By improving how close air support interacts with divisions, we can lay waste to enemy divisions with optimal support. Tactical bombs are flexible, they provoke, can perform both ground support and regular bombing. Interception detection plus 20%, fighter detection plus 15%, and fighter detection plus 10%. 
interception mission efficiency, air support mission efficiency, interception detection, and ground support 10%. We've got, um, come to realise that the Germans will send a lot of bombers over and I can't seem to... I'm going to stop the game at the moment because it, we're trying to make up our mind which is the best one to choose. If we can focus on... Battlefield support. Hmm. Um, right. I think we're gonna go for a, a strategic destruction because the air superiority and here the fighter agility, which is fantastic, air support. And we do get bombings as well. Strategic bombings, escort efficiency, bomber defense. But then again, no, let's let's go for it. Air superiority, let's go for that. Right, so we, we, we're focusing on that tree at the moment. Uh, naval doctrine is complete. Destroy sub detection. Here we go, this will submarine surface detection, submarine organization. Yep, destroy sub detection. Be... It'd be good to have air escorts, I do like that. I like the, the fact that I escort to. Because. <clears throat> the main problem is the subs and it always will be all right anti-air let's get some artillery because it's going to be important a bit later and let's continue I actually upgraded my graphics card I've now got the GTX 750 Ti I had a terrible graphics card before and I'm hoping to upgrade it a, a, again a bit later okay as so we're walking through this let's um, continue how's, how's our infantry going here hey hmm right these are complete. <coughs> My throat, I'm going to have a drink. Just a continuous cough. Right, so these I'm going to place into. can disband them. Where we've lost our general. And we're going to place in. this army here. Okay. This was quite um, quite a loss. The Queen of the Air has completed a flight around the world together with her navigator Fred Noonan. Temporary got lost while approaching Howland Island in the Pacific. And unfortunately she lost her life. Okay, um, right. Oops. Okay, and we will assign them to here. Okay, fantastic. Hopefully we we'll continue with that and this army here. Alright, Soviet withdraw. 
After a build-up of Japanese forces, the Soviet Union appears to have unexpectedly withdrawn units that were stationed right alongside the border. We'll have a look there in a bit. Um, let's give them a try. I'm just totally. Um, I don't. I don't. I just want to train an army at the moment. I don't particularly want anyone. With, I'm like save the ones with special abilities. Put them in exercise. Right, um, that was quick, very quick. Still, world tension is very low. Can't do that, can't do that, but we can. Right, this is interesting. I want to keep Mortal. Mortal was a, a huge, played a huge part in World War Two. Let's have a look at what's going on over here in the China, between China and Japan. The war hasn't started yet, but eventually China, Japan will attack China. Want to find government? Right, what are we going to do? Air experience. Let's focus on the Navy. Okay, we've got destroyers. Let's put the destroyer fleet, take them off mission, place them to here. Pause with help, and we'll combine these. Put them on the mission again. Fantastic. Now, what's wrong with these guys? Has no orders. Your orders are to exercise. Right now, this is what I want to do. Now, we've got a light cruiser. And another light cruiser. What we're going to do? I want some the light cruisers to beam with this army for now. A uh, navy fleet army. My goodness. Okay. Let's select them, and I put them back to search and destroy. Now I've got a slight problem. I know we set a timer for the episodes, but I forgot to set it. The end of the Spanish Civil War. Nationalist Spain. They're the fascists. Okay, so we've got a uh, fascist Spain in power. Looks like they're waving there, look. I thought they were. I thought they were waving. Hey, we haven't got any orders. Right. It's I, I'm, the best composition for the navies is is hard to 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 get a good composition. The best composition, which I found out sadly, is numbers. That's it. It's the numbers. What have we got here? Into subs. What I'm going to have them do I want them to Oh, this would be good. Let's 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 set them on a mission already. Convoy raiding. Can I? Fantastic. All right, let's have a convoy raid in here because I 
and here. No. Oh, can I have two? All right, we'll just focus on them too. Uh, three military factories. Right, what do we need? Mm, fantastic. I'm gonna start building artillery now. Yep, yeah, let's start with the artilleries. Artilleries, artillery units. No template. Ah, okay. Right, um, we haven't got a template. Now this is the template. If I place it here, we'll see what happens if I do that. And save. Fantastic, now that's gonna be our template with the um, infantry, so. Right, here we go. Japan, um, Japan declared war on China and their uh, vassals. Japanese build up on Chinese border. Okay, so here we go. And I have no idea how long this is going on for, for what research is being done. Now here's the problem I'm thinking at the moment. Does the... I'm not sure if the new divisions have the artillery or have to do it again. So anyway, checking. Um, I'll tell you what, let's do one more. So let me train one more time. And what we're going to do, we're going to train this again. Again, Yorkshire. And we're going to add unit. Six. And then have that on. Now, this possibly could be an uh, artillery. We'll try. Right, research available again. Fantastic. Oh, definitely. Definitely. With the Germans and their tanks. Oh, yes. Vitally important. Now, some armor. i got to pause this for two minutes because I need to look at this. Now, I'm. I'm not too focused on with our armor. We, we would need some. But against the German Panzer divisions? Hmm. Not sure. Alright, let's focus on infantry. Paratroopers, mounted infantry, not too bothered about marines. Mm. <coughs> Possibly. Oh, support weapons, of course, we haven't even done that yet. Actually, focus. Right. Now we can start. Night gains national spirit wartime industry, which grants. Civilian to military factor conversion cost minus 20%. Right, on that note, what we're going to do, our manpower is very low again. Hmm. What we're going to do, I'm going to stop recording, and because I'm not too sure of the time, I haven't really started the recording, um, started the timer. Right, so what we've done, set up a kind of battle plan for United Kingdom in Italy, uh, I'm sorry, in Africa. To, to take out the Italian provinces. We're getting ready for the war in the UK or across in mainland Europe. Navy's getting stronger. We got our subs on convoy raiding, which is great. We've got a backup fleet here. We'll see how what the Germans may have. Infantry, still in training. And I'm going to see if I can, these, I'm going to have to take them all out of the um, 
grazing area and put them back in again next time. Okay guys, well, again, thank you so much for watching, and until next time, have a fantastic day.